25. According to a team of scientists from the University of Copenhagen, two species of seed-dwelling mushroom-shaped organisms discovered off the coast of Australia cannot, at the present time, be placed in an existing phylum. The two species, named Dendrogramma enigmatica and Dendrogramma discoids, are multicellular and mostly non-symmetrical, with a dense layer of gelatinous material between the outer skin and inner stomach layers. 24. A new species of lizard-like reptiles that survived the mass extinction of the dinosaurs was found last year in South America. The newly identified species lived between 66 million and 23 million years ago in what is now Patagonia. 23. Humpback dolphins of the genus Sosa can be found along the coasts of Africa, Asia, and Australia. However, a new species doesn't become official until it gets its own scientific name, and researchers describe Sosa sahulensis as a separate species only recently, a fact that gave Australia the honor of having its own species of humpback dolphin. 22. A new frog species that can be found from Connecticut to North Carolina and emits a distinct call that sounds more like a cough than a croak was found last year. The Atlantic Coast Leopard Frog received the scientific name Rana Caffeldi after legendary ecologist Carl Caulfeld, a respected expert in reptiles and amphibians who claimed in 1937 that the tiny frog existed, but whose assertion did not gain traction in the scientific community. 21. A new species of gecko is found living among the crumbling remains of an old French fort in northern Madagascar. Although researchers first found this new species back in 2004 when they spotted a male with a broken tail, new genetic analysis and a close examination of its physical features show that it's a distinct species. According to this study, the gecko, nocturnal by nature, is a master of camouflage and seamlessly blends in with the surrounding rocks and fortress ruins. 20. This extinct dinosaur, a type of crocodilian, which roamed an ancient rainforest a few million years after the dinosaurs died, was discovered last year and was named after the fiery Balrog that lurked deep in the mines of Moria in Tolkien's Lord of the Rings. What we know about it so far is that with a blunt snout and a powerful bite, it could eat turtles and battle monster snakes. <laughs> Badass, huh? 19. A new bug similar to the common woodlouse was found on a whale carcass in 2014 by scientists aboard the RRS James Cook deep in the Southern Ocean. It was estimated that 500 to 6,000 specimens littered each square meter of the carcass. 18. A brightly colored beetle collected by Charles Darwin more than 180 years ago was finally identified as a new species in 2014 after hiding in museum storage for decades. The discovery of Darwinilla sedarisi took its scientific epithet from both Darwin and writer David Sedaris. 17. A new species of crayfish was discovered in southeast Australia's coastal lakes and is currently considered one of the world's smallest crayfish species. The tiny blue-black crustacean resembles its larger cousins that end up in cooking pots, such as lobsters and crawdads. 16. While volunteering in the Peruvian Amazon, graduate student Troy Alexander discovered this strange web formation underneath a tarp. Experts guessed it could have been slime mold, a structure made by moths, or a defense made by spiders, but everyone was stumped. After months of research, the scientists found that the web towers were used for spider eggs, but it's still not clear what species of spider made the webs, or what the picket fence circle is for. 15. In the clear waters off the coast of Peru, Researchers discovered a stunning new red coral species that was not previously described by scientists. According to the study, the new species' small size and intense red color, along with other attributes such as the shape of the coral polyps, distinguished this coral species from its relatives. 14. Even though this tiny, fragile snail with a beautiful dome-like, semi-transparent shell was technically discovered at the end of 2013, the scientific community got all the answers it was seeking about the snail in 2014. The most impressive fact about this species is that it was found living 3,000 feet or 914 meters down in a Croatian cave, and it's believed to have set a new land creep record by moving only a few millimeters per week. 13. During the summer of 2014, Laura Marsh, who has spent more than 10 years studying the Saki monkey family, uncovered five new species of these two pay monkeys in the Amazon. So what do we commoners know about the Saki monkey so far? Well, other than being characterized by floppy mops of hair that resemble the worst of human toupees, these acrobatic tree-dwelling primates are essential for dispersing seeds across the vast Amazon landscape as they primarily dine on fruit. 12. A group of ornithologists led by Dr. Manuel Schweizer from the Natural History Museum in Bern, Switzerland, 
as described a new cryptic species of owl that inhabits the desert areas of Israel, Egypt, Saudi Arabia, Jordan, Oman, and Yemen. The species scientific name, Strix hadarami, honors Israeli ornithologist and writer Hadaram Shirachai. 11. The Meritus pardus is a new species of peacock spider that has leopard spots all over its tiny body and moves like a cat. This colorful, slick spider was found in Western Australia and was named Pardis, which is Latin for leopard, as a nod to what else but the spider's leopard spots and cat-like movements. 10. This extinct 20 million year old pygmy grasshopper was found trapped in a slab of Dominican amber that lay unstudied in a collection at the University of Illinois for over 50 years. It was named after Sir David Attenborough, brother of Jurassic Park actor Richard Attenborough. 9. A multinational group of scientists headed by Dr. Scott Gardner of the University of Nebraska-Lincoln discovered four new species of burrowing rodents from the South American genus Tenomus. Commonly known as Tuco Tucos, these rodents are members of the family Octodontidae, although they are sometimes classified in their own family, Tenomidae. 8. As we all know, dinosaurs vanished a long time ago. But, in some cases, we still discover new species through buried skeletons under tons of mud and rock. This new species of dinosaur, based on fossils found in North and South Dakota, is part of a genus named after Anzu, a feathered Mesopotamian demon god. The Anzu Wylie is an oviraptorosaur, one of a group of dinos that had high crested heads, feathered bodies, and much debated diets, as most have been found with no teeth. 7. A new species named Olingito, resembling a cross between a slinky cat and a wide-eyed teddy bear, lives secretively in cloud forests of the Andes Mountains in Colombia and Ecuador. It's an arboreal carnivore that belongs to the family Procyonidae, which includes the familiar raccoon. The Olingito became the first new carnivorous mammal discovered in the Western Hemisphere in over 35 years. 6. This new species of toad is named Yunga after the Quechuan word for Warm Valley, a reference to the Peruvian rainforest where it was found last year. Scientists have argued that Ranella yunga is a distinct species from the rest of the members of the Ranella genus because it lacks a tympanum, or a toad's external ear. However, nobody knows for sure yet. 5. In June 2014, an international group of biologists discovered a new species of elephant shrew from remote northwestern Namibia. The newly discovered species was named Etendeka and refers to the distinctive flat-top mountains and rust-colored substrates of the region. 4. Last April, a team of Australian biologists discovered and described a new species of Dasiurid marsupial within the genus Antichinus. The new members of this genus are carnivorous mouse-like marsupials that are mainly found in Australia, including Tasmania and New Guinea. Keep in mind that the males mate so intensely that they die before their young are born. Sex machines, anyone? 3. A new species of marine reptile from the Jurassic era has been identified from fossils found recently on the Isle of Skye in Scotland. According to paleontologists, the dolphin-like creatures were as long as 14 feet from snout to tail and inhabited warm, shallow seas around Scotland some 170 million years ago. Their fossils are considered to be very rare, and this is the first time a newly discovered species is entirely Scottish, geographically speaking. 2. A new species of legless amphibian resembling a giant earthworm or snake was discovered in a remote but threatening area of the Cambodian rainforest during the early days of this year, even though the research had officially begun in 2014. The grey-brown creature is often mistaken for a snake, but scientists guarantee that it is nothing more than a harmless earthworm. 1. Researchers made an incredible discovery during the icy winters of 2014 in Antarctica that changed their views on which living organisms can survive in extremely cold climates. This entirely new species of sea anemone lives inside the ice and then apparently loves the cold weather more than anything. Enjoying our lists? Be sure to click that subscribe button in the top right corner so you don't miss out on new ones every Monday through Friday. Share them with your friends and help us consistently conciliate curiosity. And if you want even more lists, check out these two videos here or just head to our website at list25.com.